we get to see Zordon kick ass in a robot suit. Where we last left off, Zordon was seemingly killed by his old friend, who declared war on Earth and the Power Rangers. Working together with the Blue Emissary, Billy delved deep into his mentor's memories in order to help Zordon regain his sense of self. The successful mission ends with Zordon being put into a containment suit. Zordon then infiltrates Zardus' ship in order to destroy the Celestial Shard, a tool used to wield the powerful Imperials as weapons of mass destruction. Once Zardus flees the ship, Zordon sets its sights on obtaining the Zeo Crystal, teleporting to the moon. Back on Earth, the Celestial Shard is destroyed while fighting the Rangers, so Zardus also hits the Zeo Crystal. An epic struggle for the powerful artifact breaks out on the moon between Lord Zed, Zordon, and Zardus. As Zardus prepares to strike the final blow on Zed, Zordon grabs the Zeo Crystal and plunges it into Zardus' chest. The resulting explosion of energy vaporizes the villain, ending the war. Oh, and while this was happening, there was a whole thing on Earth with a Super Imperial, a White Tiger Dragon Zord, and a bunch of space vampires. More on that in another video. What happens after this story for another time, but for a brief moment,